All right, what's up, y'all? We are back in the Civic once again, but we got AC and it's a nice day out. God bless. This is like the first nice day, like in the ages, bro. Like, the longest time. This person thinks I'm about to blast a stop sign. They're a little jumpy on the road, but I'm filming today because we got some new tires coming for the M3. I'm excited to show you guys what the old ones look like because they are fucked up. Uh, glad to make it home and hopefully I can make it to the tire shop it's literally like a mile away so it should be fine but it's like on fucking wi like the wires for us bad um, but yeah little life hack for y'all I just wanted to share this with you guys if you're broke or just trying to save money which uh, is both a little bit of me uh, bro you can go to Burger King right download the app you can get a large fry and an eight count nugget for two dollars and sixty cents and you can just do that like three times a day. You only spend seven bucks fifty cents on food, and you're good to go. So yeah, pro tip for y'all. Also, fresh cut. Let me know what y'all think. Also, the only bad thing about Burger King is you know they're not up to date on maintenance that much. I asked for a water cup in both both of the spigots. Is that a word? Both of the spigots. We're just coming out like yellow, so definitely watch out for the water there. You probably get cancer from that shit. But also, my DoorDash got deactivated today, which is really cool. Thank God for Uber Eats or else I would just not have a way to make money. But I've seen on Reddit people have had some success getting reactivated. I haven't really done anything that wrong, so um, my fingers are crossed. They have arrived. Ooh. Big boys. Smells like tire, brother. It's tiny ass sidewall. Should wear five to one. <laughs> These things are huge, bro. Jesus Christ. Good lordy, bro. My forearm for reference. Uh, so my parents just left, so don't really have anybody that could pick me up. I don't know if I want to sit in there. Kind of sucks. Might just wait. But let me show you guys <laughs> what the tires look like right now. Just casually brake fluid that poured all over the floor. Pretty sick. Pretty freaking awesome. Shout out to Chris Fix, this is your fault. <laughs> I always knew Chris Fix was evil. discount tire without any blowouts i think we got it it's literally a mile up the road it smells good as hell in here it smells like some fresh rubber get these suckers mounted up also it's freaking crazy people wait in this freaking discount tire line to get their tire pressure checked for like 40 minutes for the you can go to any car wash place and check your own tire pressure for free and like it'll take you like one minute and people will just sit in this line so they don't have to freaking touch their tires it's mind blown. And it already feels so much better. It feels like I actually have freaking tires now before. <laughs> you can just feel the fact that there's no tread left on the fucking tires, but I'm gonna let it warm up so we can give it a little spin. Um, also clear the check engine light, so we'll see if there's any more power. I'm gonna get it tuned soon. Uh, I just need freaking money. Uh, I'll probably get the BM3 tuned, so that way we can get rid of our O2 sensor check engine light. But, in there was talking boys <laughs> this dude was yapping right i don't like to talk shit but golly bro is like making a sale to another customer and they're just getting his tire changed he's like yeah man i got this this morning focus thing bro he's just out here making sales 
sales. <laughs> all the random people just chilling, waiting for their tires. And he's making all kinds of jokes to the to the, the person up front. Bro, he's just he's talking, bro. I think his morning focus might have been Adderall or something, bro. But yeah, let this thing warm up a little bit. drivetrain malfunction thing a lot whenever I go on the highway I'm wondering if it somehow notices because of the tires I'm hoping that fixes it but it could also just be because of the check engine light so either way I'm gonna get the tune just so I don't have a freaking check engine light because obviously that's not a good thing to just roll around with but I do wonder if that'll make a difference because it would never ever pop up below like 65 so I don't know I guess we'll see if I keep driving it Definitely wasn't the tires, <laughs> so that's pretty sick. Just a good car. It doesn't really work ever, but sick car. Hey, your boys about to have a goddamn panic attack, so I'm like, all right, try to change my function. I can just drop the car off, and hopefully they'll fix it for free, and I can work in the Civic, right? Hop in the Civic, the fucking AC does not work again, which is blasphemy, because I literally just drove it home, and the AC was working fine. Pull the glove box out. I literally touched the blower motor and it started working again. So I guess that's, I just have the magic touch. Whew, a lot of stuff, man. There's a lot of stuff going inside my brain right now, but as long as I can just work, I should be okay. And hopefully my dad, God bless my parents uh, for helping me out. Uh, so my dad's gonna pick me up from the shop. So that way I don't have to freaking sit there. Hopefully they can fix the drivetrain malfunction. So I don't know what the fuck is up with that. And praying to God that it isn't a battery thing because the batteries are like 3K. Just gonna not think about it. Or just gonna drop the freaking car off. Once again, won't be able to drive this freaking thing, but whatever, I just want it to actually work. So fingers crossed.